Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas. I'm your host, and I'm here with TNT Dynamite, the explosive one. Jonas, you're the man on the sticks. I have them. And we're going to play some Madden 19, Sugar Plum. Yes, sir. Madden 19 relocated. Toronto Mounties rebuild. As always, playing that offense only. Simmon that D. Using that balanced playbook. And uh, we're chugging along as the Mounties. We're always getting our man. We're chugging along. Yeah, dude. We got sticky hands. We got fucking all sorts of shit going on. We got Hillenmeyer. Hillenberger. I don't even remember his fucking name. It's st sticky fingers, I Sticky believe. fingers. There was the hooker on our team. <laughs> what? Prostituting himself like no other. We have a hooker named Sticky Fingers? No, he's named Malik. Oh, Malik Hooker. M Malik's the hooker. That's a terrible bad name to have, man. Or last Everybody name to have. Yeah, dude. I kind of wish I was Mr. Hooker, though. Uh, I don't know if I would go for that. Would Mis you be like rather be Mr. Pimp? Mr. Gigolo. If, dude, if there's somebody with the last name Pimp, it's P-Y-M-P, too. <laughs> That's even more Pimp than P-I-M-P. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, that'd be a great life. It would be. It'd be very nice, name. dude. Jonas, yeah. if, if you ever have a child, what would you name it? Guy or girl? Let's say a little boy. A little. Oh, Barkley's barking up the fucking field, sir. A boy? A little Jonas oh. Jr. A little Joni Jr. Uh, Xavier or Xanthus with an X. I like X names, dude. Xavier, uh, Xavier, I like, but Xanthus, you, you're just asking that kid to get made fun of. <laughs> right? Yeah, I know. It'd be unique. I like Xavier a lot. Like, I mean, is it set in stone? Is that what I would need? No, I don't no. care. I really don't care enough, but, like, it would be cool. When it comes down to it, it's never really the guy's choice anyway. Yeah, I know, right? It always boils down to what the woman wants. Well, I feel like the guy may have a little more say if it's a son. But, oh, like, yeah, but yeah. if, like, if they have a daughter... Though I, I would think like on average, probably most guys want a boy. Most girls want a girl, you know, so they probably have like their dream woman. Like as for a preferable woman's name, if we if I ever had a woman, girl, child, <laughs> a woman, if you had a woman, oh, no, a girl, child, <laughs> if your wife just gave birth to a full grown woman, <laughs> high heels, briefcase and pantsuit, I, I, a pantsuit. <laughs> I uh, do not have a preference for a girl's name. No? No, nah, not real. Oh, my God. Did you see him? Did see, you see him? That's, a, that's a pretty early in the game to be Pucking smart. Fucking Barkley. And see, I, I, never had a, I never had a preference uh, up to climbing the ladder. Oh, They're shit. Up, you got to get the maple syrup. Going to the, the top tree. of the mountain tree. You know, the syrup jokes are never going to stop. No, dude, it's come on. It's too easy. It is. Like everything. They're going to get their free marijuana at the top of the building. And we've all been trained in America since birth to make fun of Canadians oh, and their love of syrup. fun. What? No, dude. I, I they, respect Canudia. Dude, come on. They they know. <laughs> they know. Wow. We have an odd relationship with Canada. Do we? They're like our stepbrother. <laughs> is, that, is that how we treat them? I don't want to say that. I'd say more like a big brother. They're our big brother. No, we're their big brother. Oh, I got you. Like, like we poke fun and things are. It's like, but we love you. Yeah. I got you. <laughs> yeah. When the shit went down, Canada, we're going to be there. Well, right? we got your back, homie. Yeah. But like, God forbid, like the Russians attack Canada or something. You know damn well America's got to do something. We'd be right there. Yeah. yeah, we live in the same fucking house, man. Basically, they're, yeah. They're just going to attack us next. Yeah. I feel you. Yeah, that makes I like sense. this Canada analogy. Yeah, it's very, it is. It's like. And uh, it'd be very good. Oh, my God. Their run defense is fucking trash. No, no, no. Blocky McBlockface, you son of a bitch. So what would you name a, your boy? You know, I've never had a preference for a son's name, but I've always had a press, press, preference for a little Really? Girl. You're you're going against the grain I here. do go against the grain. On everything. What would, <laughs> what, what would it be? I've always liked it. Like, just A-Y-A, Aya, or, like, Alisa. Oh, with Elisa with an E or Elisa with an A? Like A L I S A. Oh, yeah. Elisa, Alyssa. I, I, I would maybe, uh, if I couldn't afford the car, I'd probably name my daughter Alexis. Oh, shit. <laughs> That's a joke. That's a Kane West. It's a bad one. Um, <laughs> a bad one. Yeah. No, he's, nah, your, dude. he's your favorite. 
Yeah, I, I do like Kanye's music. I mean, him himself, I don't know. I don't know if I'd be his fucking... <laughs> yeah, how do you feel about R. Kelly? Oh! I heard he does things that aren't right. <laughs> I heard he does things that aren't right. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's unfortunate, man. But, uh... Yeah, I mean, he's a talented musician, but that doesn't... <laughs> All not all talented people are good people. You know what I mean? Just because you got a set of pipes, don't mean you fucking. Wait, Jonas, you gotta go sticking your pipes everywhere. Is that what you're saying? Pipes? What? No, nothing. I don't know. Yeah, dude. You I mean, lost me. You know? I don't know, man. It's just, dude. You know what I saw today? <laughs> what? God, us all flustered with the R. Kelly talk. Dude, R. Kelly. Was just, <laughs> woo, like I don't know how to make this funny and not be offensive. I know, right? <laughs> I'm like, he did things. He's a bad man. I mean, he did some really sh fucked up shit, allegedly. <laughs> no, dude. Tell your other story. We gotta get off of R. Kelly. It's yeah, gonna... dude. <laughs> you get off on R. Kelly. <laughs> Somebody's eventually gonna say something they should. Yeah, I know, right? Um, so th there was this guy who uh, he had back pain. Okay. And he was like, Aspirin. Oh that? man! And like, he's like, it hurts. And he like, <laughs> I need to get rid of this back pain. And Great story. So he went to so the far. ER. Damn it, you son of a bitch. No, no, she can't go getting sacked. It's too early. Hillenmeyer, dude. I know, I just need to run because that seems to be good. So, and he had, like, his arm was all fucked up. And they were like... <laughs> you said it was his back. Which right. one is it? His back was hurting him. He went to the ER after time, and they were like, what's wrong with this dude's arm? Turns out he was self-medicating himself. How was he doing that? I fucking turned this into a run play somehow. Yeah, he probably he one. was injecting his own semen into his veins because he said that it would heal his back problem. Wait. Oh, Seals Jones. Oh, get it, friend. Oh, you son of a bitch. Oh, that's bullshit. Wait a minute, Jones. He was injecting. He bought a hypodermic needle offline. And was Just one? One. And was injecting semen into his arm. Jonas, and he had like an oh, air pocket in his arm. Stop. Yeah. Stop. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I know. Stop. I can't think about this. I'm going to try to kick a 58-yard field goal. We're not going to get it. Somehow so. somehow this is worse than the R. Kelly. <laughs> Some, <laughs> somehow this I mean, like, for his body, yeah. Somehow this is worse. Why would <laughs> We kicked a 58-yard field goal, dude. Good shit. Which one is that? Uh, I don't Koo? know his last name. Is that Koo Young Hose? No. Koo Young... Who is... Where does that even exist? Oh, yeah. That, that man That's a different universe, man. That's, That's like talking universe. about Batman and Spider-Man movies. <laughs> That's Dimension X. Dimension X. Uh, yeah, dude. It's fucked up. <laughs> yeah, it is fucked up. Right, Thank dude. Thank you. It caused me physical trauma. <laughs> like, I... It changed my body chemistry when you said that. <laughs> I figured you would like that. It elicited emotion. Oh my god. Yeah, All right. Yeah. It, it really, really. Oh shit. Break it. Oh god. Break. Oh. oh. He broke it and then just fell down. Yeah, dude. His, knee, his knee gave out. His knee, he was injecting semen into his arms and. Stop. <laughs> Oh, I know, dude. I want. Uh, I don't. What was his diagnosis then? Oh, he just had back pain, dude. He had a. What yeah, it, but he, no. Oh, what did it say? He had a. Uh, they did something. They gave him like micro antibiotics or some shit because he was all fucked up. And then like, and then he, and then he checked himself out of the hospital once his back stopped hurting. And that's what I'm, I'm trying to figure out because okay, so he had the back pain, but the back pain was not being caused by the IV uh, semen. No, he said he thought that would hurt. So he thought him. that would fix it. Right. But I imagine that there would have to be some sort of repercussions for injecting seed into your arm. Oh, I bet. I don't know. Like, it didn't, what does it didn't that get, give It didn't you? get that detailed about it, but. Did he get superpowers? Not like No Nut November or anything. No, that's over. Oh, this fucking trick ass B. It's, it's, it's past. We're past de Destroy Dick December. Wow. That's when you got to let out all your aggression from no nut. Oh, November. so you don't nut all November, and then you, you nut three times a day day. all through December. <laughs> leading up to Christmas. Dude, I can't remember the rules for the Destroy Dick December, but I think it was like seven times a day or some seven shit. Seven times. Yeah, for 30 days. <laughs> oh, my God. Days. Destroy Dick. Uh, yeah, I guess so. They come up to the line Definitely <laughs> would be mission accomplished. <laughs> Holy shit. You got to, like, destroy that motherfucker. Boy, I wish Ricky Seals Jones would be fast. 
He is fast. Watch, watch this play. Here he comes. Oh! Oh shit! I faked that guy out by doing nothing. Fingers just coated in Buttersworth. <laughs> Mrs. B all over his H's. <laughs> shit. <laughs> Why is our coach a crip? I mean a blood. Jesus. Wow. <laughs> you're fat shaming him, now you're fucking poo shaming him. Too. Why is he a blood? Dude, he rolls with the Treyway, bro. Like he rolls with the Treyway, bro. Pyru love. <laughs> <laughs> this is like oh when you my say a, god This is like when you say Hispanic things <laughs> You do it with a certain accent That just like elicits that That I'm white as fuck <laughs> <laughs> He's yelling <clears throat> Sue woo <laughs> Them gangsters love him <laughs> 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 oh, shit. oh my <laughs> god! No, you didn't even like six nine. No, I don't. No, you didn't care. For he him. screamed to Sue Wu. Oh, oh, that's, that's oh, an offense. He that's He's defensive. like, listen, I'm sending the the, the crew. Ooh. Yes, sir. What is that? The one yard line? Uh, the three. The three. Oh, I'm getting fired, and mom's gonna take me out and make me pay for lunch. <laughs> the Packers. <laughs> Jonas, give, give me some uh, history on the name Packers. Why are they called the Packers? Uh, because they pack things. No, I know you know the real story. Uh, I don't know. Oh, I'm okay. part owner of the Green Bay Packers in real life. Boom. Boom. That is true. Little whip. Yeah, I know you have like that plaque in your room that says that you own like a, a, a piece of the piece team. Piece of the pie. Aaron Rodgers calls me every Sunday and tells much, me how he's feeling. How much do you own? Because I know it's like an insignificant it's just amount. just one share. <laughs> One share of Packers how many, how many pieces of NFL team do you own? How much is it worth? Uh, nothing. Wait, what do you mean nothing? It, okay, it, <clears throat> hold on. I got it. The surgeon! Oh, oh my God, they killed him. You paid, it was, I don't know, it was like, it was like, uh, like 200 bucks or something, right? 200 bucks. Something like that, roundaboutly. Okay. And you bought a share of the team. Yeah. You can't resell it. You can give it down through your family, but, um, and the value doesn't fluctuate. It's not like a stock, but they do like when they have their owner meeting they're in, in, uh, whenever it is in the summer, yeah. I get a letter every year. I can go to the owner meeting if I want to go to Wisconsin. I get to vote on like who is on their board and shit. I just don't really care because I'm not. I don't even really care for the Packers all that much. No, you son of a bitch. Oh, I'm, throw, I'm, I'm throw, throwing the game because I, I'm part owner. Um, <laughs> and like it was. A, but actually, so it's fact, more of a collector's item. Kind Basically, of. Basically, it's kind of I mean, of like I, I am truly part owner of the Packers, so I do get to vote on their fucking board of directors, and I can go to their owner meeting and that kind of shit. Um, I mean, but you don't. I'm not going to drive to Wisconsin, bro. From Texas just to go fucking vote on something I don't give a shit about? Oh, what are you doing? I don't know. Did dude. you see that? He just stopped. He nanayed. Why did your, why, did your button let up off of the stick? I don't know what it did. I think the game <laughs> You don't good. know what it I literally did nothing different, and he just decided to stop. Um, uh, I'm asking but, about your sticks. Yeah, maybe I broke my stick. Uh, they, they, this is the only NFL team that's publicly owned. No, no other team. Every other team's owned by one guy or a group, a conglomerate, but so, mainly one guy. So, but like you can't, you can't resell it though. It no, doesn't, it doesn't increase in value. It no. doesn't depreciate. Exactly, it's a, it's just a piece of history. Well, that's that's weird. I don't know if I get. Oh, it. Seals Jones. I don't it, know if well, I what they did that that the time they sold them this time was they uh they were renovating the stadium, so they wanted to raise money to like put lights in and shit like that, and. Uh, Oh, so, my Jesus. Holidays on a holiday, folks. Uh, so that's why they've only sold s s shares of the team like three times in its existence. And this last time was in like 20 hours. They always seven. use this, uh, this method? Because to me, it's almost like you, you paid the money just to get like uh, the rights of a person who owns the team. Kind of, yeah. Yeah. But, I mean, hey, I can say I'm part owner. 
I'm not gonna take I mean, that I, away. You can't from take you. that away from I'm me. I'm not dude. gonna take it away. You from can't you. ruin my ownerdom. But like, I don't know. If if I own a car, I can sell that bitch right now. Yeah, dude, I feel you. <laughs> I guess you could sell your your ticket, right? Yeah, but I'd still get the letter. Oh, you couldn't have it, like, forwarded to somebody else? I, mean, I guess. I could, like, be like, hey, I'm dead, and Joe Schmo is my son. Well, I, I, you know what? I don't know. It's still cool. Do you own any any of the Browns? You can't. Go buy some. You can't. Go buy some stock. They don't have stock. It's not the same thing. Teams don't have stock. No, they do not. There's no team stock. No, there is not. Get Only the here. Packers. Why do they not have stock in their team? How do they fund it? Be by rich guys. So like every every team has one owner. Every owns team, the team is privately owned. Yes. Oh, wow, that's fucking crazy. And then, uh, except for the Packers, who's owned by the city and the not the city, like the the shareholders. What? There's that many rich people. Uh, thirty one. I mean, but then you think of like NBA and MLB and yeah, and some of them guys own more than one team. That's how fucking filthy rich they are. This motherfucking team is way too pass guardy. Jonas, I need fucking team ownership money. Right. Oh, yeah. That's really? like. But, dude, do you know how much, like, a fucking team is? Yeah, I'm aware. It's a lot. Dude. No shit. Like, I mean, if we save up for a couple weeks, we should be able to get one. <laughs> save up all those fucking YouTube checks. Yeah, right, dude. Like, like I think the Browns were bought for a billion dollars. Oh, is that all? Yeah, just a billion. And that was extra money he had. I was just trying to get like, I was just trying to get like 10k. And then you got to think of it like this: like if you're gonna buy a team, you're probably gonna buy a lower end team, right? Well, because the higher end teams don't really come up for sale, and then exactly. when they die, they keep them in the family. Like the wife takes over, the kids. Nobody's take over. buying the Lakers, all right? You're not yeah, buying actually. The they did sell. No, the Dodgers recently got sold. Yeah, Magic you're not Johnson buying was. the Yankees. You're no. not buying the Lakers. That's staying in the family. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's like. Holy shit, wow. Blockface. Where did he come from? Uh, Blockface's mother's house. He was just laying pipe to Blockface's mom. Wow, J- Jonas. <laughs> Do we have to be crass? <laughs> Is that where we got to go? I mean, that's what was happening. We haven't talked about R. Kelly in so long. <laughs> yeah, we, we've not touched base on R. Kelly in a, in a very, very long time. Thank God. <laughs> yeah, man. But yeah, that's 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 it. Yeah, I, I need mean, that kind of money though. Yeah, dude, that's, I would. That's good I would. Money. Dude, I would love to own an NFL team. It'd be like my fucking dude. I would love to own an, an NHL team. No. Like any team. No. You Ooh, don't Freeman's even like, out there. Rhett himself. You don't even like hockey. Wretched Rhett Freeman. No, Jones, don't yell into the microphone. <laughs> That was really loud. <laughs> don't. <laughs> don't <laughs> you don't even like hockey though. I mean, I don't not like hockey. I'm just indifferent about it. I don't really know hockey. Like, I watch, I will watch a live hockey game, faux show. Well, I don't think that the opposite. Oh, God, oh, God he split him like a goddamn, like he's Moses. He's Moses. He was like, oh, and, hey, Packers, are you the Red Sea? Because I'm splitting your ass. Oh, he's doing the finger guns? Yeah, dude, he's like, he's fucking Shooter McGavin's brother. Dude, Logan Hillenmeyer. We are blowing these dudes right out of the water. Not yeah, you, really. what, we got to watch that pause. <laughs> We're blowing these dudes right out of the water. <laughs> we are. <laughs> well, it just depends. There was a little comma there. I didn't put too many. Yeah. Put a, there, there wasn't a, uh, what's that called? A, uh, an ellipsis. An ellipsis? That's three dots, kids. Oh, block face. And oh, block face. Get out of my face. Oh, my Ooh. God. And then Mack truck came like. Burr, burr. <laughs> all right. Why is he all fucking win? five o'clock shadowed up, dude? Blood's got to roll clean. <laughs> dude, he didn't go to the barbershop this week. God. He's got fucking pyru fuzz. Pyru fuzz. <laughs> I could picture tripping, him. I could, tripping ain't easy, fucking. I could picture him on the on the field. What's up, blood? Okay, I need you to run this play. <laughs> what up, blood? I got you. <laughs> I need you to toss this up, blood. All right, blood, let's go. They have gangs in Canada. <laughs> oh Jesus! They have Canadian Football League. <laughs> no, no. Oh, the football. I don't know if they have street games. <laughs> street. Oh God, that'd be cool. Are there Canadian bloods, dude? You got Google <laughs> that shit. You got your Crips. phone. I got the sticks, dog. <laughs> 
Dude, what look it up. Thing? We have to see if they have Canadian street gangs and what oh they're called. Oh, my God. All right, that's fine. It, that's that, important. It is actually worth looking up. It, <laughs> yeah, this really. is actually And now I'm worth super curious because, like, if they do, that's what we're calling our team from now on. Canadian street <laughs> gangs. What are the biggest gangs in Canada? <laughs> there is none. Hell's Angels? No, oh, that's a motorcycle club, though. Well, I mean, they're still a gang. Oh, right? yeah. For just sure. like good guys, I guess. They do good things, right? Uh, depending on the chapter. It's funny because when I type in Canadian street gangs, I get a picture of a bunch of bears. In the <laughs> <laughs> it's just black bears in the wilderness. It really it? is. <laughs> Seals Jones, can he ever get out alive, folks? Dude, I don't think I don't think there are. There has to be, dude. Gangs Come on. are mostly present in the major urban areas of Canada. Canada. I always call it Canada. I don't know. Yeah, this sounds about right. At least I knew the capital. Uh, uh, I know the capital too. <laughs> Thank you. Now, Calgary, of course. <laughs> yeah. Yes. <laughs> I don't know, man. The Wikipedia audio, art, audio, article keeps taking me to some bullshit. Eight brutal Canadian gangs you never Oh, suspected. shit, dude. Lurking north of the border. The most brutal Canadian I got gangs. a delay of game, and I was hitting the button a million times. I don't know if I believe you. I, uh, you don't have to. I don't care. Oh, it was a BC drug war. Oh, God, the British oh Columbians are fucking all pissed off. Oh, no. Oh, God. The first one. What's it called? The WBP. W, what's it stand for? <laughs> it is the Neo-Nazi oh. White Boy Posse. Oh, my God. The White Boy Posse, huh? <laughs> Oh, the geez. first one wow, that I see dude. on the list. Why are the neo-Nazis everywhere? <laughs> oh, the surgeon, folks. He's, he's fucking, he got a kidney operation at the end zone in 10 seconds. <laughs> the white boy posse. <laughs> oh, my God. Like, okay, listen. Like, I'm all for if you want to be in a street gang, but, like. <laughs> Just be out to get the money, not for hate. <laughs> but, like. Why, Violence why, against the community, fine. But don't hate. Why it's, white boy posse? Like that just sounds like unlegit. That's not even not even a word. But <laughs> oh my god, I threw down my clipboard. Did you see that? He says. <laughs> There's one called the United Nations. <laughs> like the real one. Like. Yeah. Yeah. I know they just right call the themselves the, no, that's the Bacon Brothers. The Bacon? Are you fucking I'm kidding not me? Not even lying, dude. I'm just reading. Shit. Dude, <laughs> the Bacon Brothers. That is awesome. <laughs> I don't know what is the infatuation with them in breakfast. Yeah, they're like, oh, oh is he gonna Saquon? make it? Holy oh, shit! shit. Go into the country. He's going to eat some maple syrup. Oh, oh he, he kicks, kicks the fucking door fucking down. Doors. Damn. Durr. Saquon ain't living it unless it's solid oak, bitch. <laughs> Come on, dude. Could you get this motherfucking... The, the Bacon Brothers, dude. Like, really? Could you get this fucking bullshit off of The Bacon Brothers, the Surrey Six Murders. Surrey Six Murders. No, that was... Uh... Oh, wait, no. This is the... That's what the Bacon Brothers did. They killed a bunch of people. Jesus. The Galloway Boys. The Galloway Boys. Yeah, dude. Gangs from We have a guy country. on our team named Galladay. Well, that's, the Galladay that, boys. No, Jonas, stop. It doesn't work. But <laughs> fucking, those are uh, those are the basic ones I found. But white boy posse was definitely worth the entire look up. Oh, absolutely, the white boy posse. <laughs> oh, Jesus God. <laughs> them your people, Jonas. No, dude, they ain't my people. Not them, not them fucking neo Nazi guys. <laughs> not the neo not, I'm not claiming them, dude. Uh, I don't dude. I'm importing them motherfuckers to the mothership. Yeah, well, I don't claim the Bacon Brothers. <laughs> dude, the Bacon Brothers sound neat, other than the murder they did. <laughs> a lot of murders, apparently. Okay, Ooh, all right. Never, oh, oh, my God. Leaping oh, Jack Frost. Fucking Ocho Cinco shit you did there. He was fucking playing possum. Yeah, dude, I don't know. Street gang. They don't have any Crips. We need to start the Crips in Canada. Well, I'm sure they probably have, like, an ancillary to it. The, the Crip, the, ch the Toronto chapter of the Crips? <laughs> the Toronto Crips. I like the Canadian Crips. <laughs> that sounds way awesome. <laughs> I like that. Ooh. 
What we got? <laughs> Fourth and inches, huh? Instead of pot leaves, they just like <laughs> Oh, Jesus, God. <laughs> what would they do instead of crib walking? I guess they do, like... They, they'd fucking bacon walk. They go out for a rip. Oh come on, you motherfucker! Get some fucking juice in your arm. Crip ripping. Crip rip. Yeah, out for a rip, eh, bud? Out for a rip, eh, bud? Yeah, what would we what would we call it in uh, Canada? I'm pretty sure that's what it would be. It would be. <coughs> Don't a... you know anything about Canada? About Canada? Yeah, you know. I know about... that uh, they speak English and French there. They do. not everywhere. But in different parts. Jonas, let me teach you some French. Pomplamoose. Pomplam. Oh, oh my God! How is this man Dude, even a man? He is the barkiest Barkley Dude, that there how ever is he was. A man? He's not a man. He's, He's not human. Look at him. The backwards <laughs> running man. I don't know what that was. I don't either. Dude, he was saluting the fucking Canadian flag. He, <laughs> that's he what, was. That's what they do. Was it? Um, what else do I know about Canada? Uh, they got- had an amusement park named Marineland. Pomplamoose. They have uh, Niagara Falls. People have went over it in a barrel. One person went over it in a the barrel. There's been more than one. Well, yeah, and the rest of them are dead. You're dead. I think one person did it and lived. Oh, this, oh, my God, the surgeon's on fire, folks. Oh, my God, Jonas. Let him die. <laughs> Just He's, let him die. Man. Oh, let's see. What are you doing? What's your signature? Just, just pointing into the crowd. Sim out the rest of the game. Ooh, it, it's over. It's the end. So, yes, I will do that for you. I'd sim out the rest of the game for you. Yeah. Just for you. Oh, my God. Son of a bit. My mashed potatoes aren't cooked yet. <laughs> God damn it. I hate cold, lumpy potatoes. Just like my mother. His mom's a cold, lumpy potato? <laughs> yeah. Well, that's, that's right. Just, this is rude. <laughs> no more rude than you fat shaming our coach. I don't even know what you're talking. I haven't fat shamed him all episode. <laughs> it's very true. Oh shit! Sorry, all right, everybody. That is all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Go ahead and lie to your friends while you're at it. Tell them to sub too. Tell them we're worthwhile. Tell them that we might be a little bit chuckly. Why does that guy have like mud on his arm? Anyways, what the fuck is a chuckly? It's a made-up word I just did for Jonas. For TNT Dynamite, we thanks for tuning in. Are alongside Charles Davis, we thank our entire